Hey all, Jay here. Now I'd like to show you how to make a simple working repeater door lock. As you can see that the lock is only activated when the lever is down. And it works on both ends of the house. Unfortunately, I only have the design for single door systems, but eventually there will be a double door system that I will work on. So anyways, let's get into So this door lock system is built on what I like to call the repeater lock system, which the name is self-explanatory, it literally locks a repeater. Say, so when I turn on this power source here, the repeater's on, it will leave the door open. However, when I turn this one on, it locks this repeater with bedrock somehow. <laughs> I'm questioning that. And then, when, and then all power is blocked. Of course, this won't work here, so we can get rid of it. But it just locks that repeater. However, when you turn on this the lock while the power source is on, the power source will stay activated until the lock is off again. And so yeah, watch a couple of examples. Pretty good examples. So for this build, you will need a block of your choice for the building, a lever, two buttons, two redstone repeaters, a bunch of redstone, I don't know, maybe let's say one stack, and an iron door. The rule here is just to show you the different circuits. Now you want to start off by making your iron door frame as such. You can do this to any side, but I would always, I'm going to the left, I will show both sides, however. You want a 5 by whatever height your building is, like wall, as such, I'm going to do it both sides to show that it does work, and it doesn't matter on what direction you are in, and then on the third block, you will need to place a button. Now. On the block, right before the door, you'll have to place a redstone repeater. As the, cir as the circuit, this is how it works. That's, that's how I'm going to say it. Then you want to put an iron block behind the redstone repeaters. And with a block of redstone. I can't believe I forgot the redstone. And then, we'll see to it, that the doors open. Now, I think it's... I'm going to go four blocks deep. I don't exactly remember. I've, I was meant to place wool here. Hang on a second, I was meant to place wool here. I'm... Like, I forgot. What up? But I was meant to be doing that. Repeater. Redstone. And now, you want to put a repeater directly beside, like that. Make sure they're set to one tick, which is the default, just in case you accidentally click. And that's done. And then we want to place. Hang on. Again. I'm new to this whole tutorial stuff. And then you want to place one block above and put a block of redstone on it. Not a block of redstone. Just some redstone. Why does this feel so thin? And as you can see, that circuit is blocked. Now, I'll have to modify this circuit a bit on the other side as I can only have one lever. As you can see it's all blocked. 
doors will not open. Turn them off. And now, we would want to finish this circuit. As such, we want to place a button here. Let's do that. Place a button here. Because I'm doing both sides. And then you would like to place a button. Oh, not a button. A block of whatever. Two blocks away. And put a dab of redstone dust on it. Should activate when the button is pressed. And you can restore it all to the ground. And then if it's... And then your circuit should work. I'm going to do the same to the other side. This is just... And now, the circuit will work. To prove it to both sides that it works. You should always test your contraptions before confirming it because you wouldn't want someone else to not be able to use your contraption. Now to lock those, lock them, I said lock. Locked, 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 and locked. And now, I made those too far apart, so I'm going to fix that up, just bring it in one. Don't be a klutz like me. And then you want to cover it all up. This one looks perfect. This one I did a good job. And you just want to cover it all up. I recommend just putting a torch in there so that monsters do not spawn in there at night. The torch is just there as a safety precaution. Yeah, that's, I like that. Safety precaution. And then you can just happily build the rest of your house. And... Unfortunately, you have to deal with this passage. It's extremely annoying. Yeah, there you have it. A working door lock. It is simple and doesn't take much resources. Easily made in survival. So I'll probably be on Twitch for inspiration if you just want to give me any ideas as I want inspiration so that I can implement as much redstone as I can into a giant city that I will one day release to the public. Anyways, that's all for now.